Hello children, I hope you are feeling happy and strong today. I welcome you to this special English hour. Today we will sing, dance and listen to stories. Are you ready to have some fun? Come closer to the TV and join me in a fun song. Climb on board the juk juk train. There are so many things to see. Put your eye. Climb on board the juk juk train. There are so many things to see. Put your right hand up, then your left hand up. Go juk 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 juk. Children, today we are going to learn about ourselves. Can you tell me what is your favorite thing about your school? I hope you may have many favorite things about your school. When I was young, my favorite thing was to sit in the library and read books. And I also loved to share food with my friends. Now, can you share which is your favorite food? I know you may have many favorite foods. I love dal and rice made by my mother. It tastes really yummy. Now, I would like to know what is the hobby that you like to do in your free time like singing, drawing, reading and dancing. My favorite hobby is dancing. I love to dance in my free time. We know that words are important to study new language. Let's have a look at few new words. The first word is R A I N B O W Rainbow, rainbow, rainbow. Rainbow has seven colors. We see rainbow when it rains. The second word is F A I R Y. Fairy, fairy, fairy. I love reading fairy tales. Cinderella is my favorite fairy tale. The third word is W I N G S. Wings. Wings, wings. Birds fly with the help of their wings. The butterflies have 
colorful wings. The fourth word is J O U R N E Y Journey 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 My journey to Kashmir was wonderful. It is a long journey. The fifth word is C A N D Y F L O S S Candy Floss Candy Floss, candy floss. I like to eat candy floss. My father will buy candy floss for my brother and me. Let's revise the words once again. My favorite things. Rainbows and fairy cakes and butterfly wings a journey on a train a visit from a friend candy floss and ice cream the list might never end Children, since you now sang the poem with me, let's try to find out the rhyming words from the poem. We all know rhyming words are words that have a similar sound. Let's try to find the rhyming words. The first pair of rhyming words is things and wings. The second pair of rhyming words is friend and end. I hope you all were able to find the rhyming words from the poem. Now, Let's try to spot food items from the poem. I'm sure you'll be able to find it. Let's see the first food item from the poem. That is cake. The second food item is my favorite candy floss. And the third food item is ice cream. I hope you had fun searching for the food items in the poem. Children, now let's play a fun game. On your screen, you will be shown two columns. Column A and column B. Column A will have pictures and column B will have words. You have to match the pictures with their correct words. Let's get started. Children, can you see the first picture? What do you think it is? Yes, it is a Rainbow. Now let's see the second picture. Can you guess what it is? Correct. It is a 
train. Now let's see the third picture. What do you see? Yes, it is a cake. Now let's see the fourth picture. Can you guess what it is? Correct. It is a butterfly. Now let's see the fifth picture. What do you think this object is? Yes, it is an ice cream. I hope you had fun. Now let's learn about position words. Do you know what are position words? Words that tell us about the position of a person or an object is called a position word. For example, the ball is on the table. The word on is a position word because it is telling us about the position of the ball. Now, we will do an activity. You will see a picture and you have to guess the positions of the cats in the picture. Sounds interesting? Let's get started. Children, do you see this picture? There is a car in this picture. And we can see a lot of cats in this picture. Let's try to find the positions of these cats. Do you see this cat? Where do you think she is sitting? Yes, she is sitting on the car. The cat is O N on. The cat is on the car. Now let's see this cat. Where do you think she is? Correct. She is in the car. The cat is I N in. The cat is in the car. Now let's see this cat here. Where do you think she is sitting? Can you guess? Yes, the cat is behind the car. B E H I N D. Behind. The cat is behind the car. Do you see this small cat here? Where do you think she is sitting? Yes, the cat is under the car. U N D E R. Under. The cat is under the car. Now, let's have a look at this cat. The color of this cat is black. And where do you think she is sitting? Yes, the cat is near the car. N E A R. Near. The cat is near the car. Now let's see this cat. 
Where do you think this cat is sitting? Yes, the cat is beside the car. B E S I D E beside the cat is beside the car. Now, do you see this cat? It's looking so tiny. Where do you think she is sitting? Yes, the cat is far from the car. F A R Far The cat is far away from the car. And that's the reason it's appearing tiny. Now we saw the different positions of the cats. I hope you had fun doing this activity. In this activity, we saw that in, on, near, behind, beside, far were some of the position words. I hope you enjoyed this activity. Children, now let's color the ice cream. For that, you can take a white paper and draw an ice cream. I have already drawn it and I have colored the cone with brown color. Now, let's outline the ice cream. I have used black color sketch pen. You may use your own favorite color to outline the ice cream. Here is the cherry. Let's outline the cherry. Our outline is done. And we have already colored the cone. Now, let's color the upper part of the ice cream. Now, let's use a different color to color this part of the ice cream. Now, this is a cherry. And what is the color of a cherry? Yes, the color of cherry is red. Now, this part of our cone is left to be colored. So, I will use brown color to fill this part. 
my orange ice cream with some strawberry and the cherry is ready. I hope you enjoyed coloring the ice cream. Children, today we learned the poem Favorite Things. You may read the poem a few more times from your textbook and also draw an ice cream in your notebook and color it with your favorite colors. I will see you in the next session. Until then, take care, stay safe and bye-bye.